latest, 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 late. It's a Friday night. I've been ill the past couple of days. Felt like shit. Threw up everywhere as well. So, <laughs> very tired for some reason. I think I might just hit something to disagree with me and it kicked my ass basically. But, you know, you've got to keep going. What can I say? Now, Friday's going to be a quick one. We've only got a couple of pre-orders worth talking about, but there are a few sale items I'm going to talk about as well. Around the markets, there isn't much really happening at the moment, but just a couple of things I want to pinpoint for you, which are bargains. And then I've got three pickups for you. There are more due tomorrow, but what can I do? They ain't come yet. And then I'm going to give away a couple of 4Ks. How do you like them apples, eh? Let's get this done. Now, pre-orders wise, yeah, there's a few bits and bobs around, but nothing that's really got a decent cover to it or really a, a date nailed down. So I'm just going to go for a couple which are okay. First one we've got is the Saw Legacy Collection. Now, technically, this is already out, but even second hand, it's 45 quid at the moment. But on the May 17th, there is a £40 version of the same Legacy set coming out on Amazon. So for 40 quid you can have them all brand new, or 45 quid you can have them second hand, so which way do you want to look at it? Um, I'll say not a bad deal, I've already got them all myself so I don't need it, but anyone who hasn't got them and wants them, now you know you can get cheaper brand new than you can second hand. And the other one we were looking at, which kind of annoys me a bit, um, they released Tower of the Dark, then they did it in a steelbook, now they're doing it 4K and a 4K steelbook. Why don't you just release it all at the same time you chits? But, how the Duck 4K still books out on the 5th of July and then we've got the normal 4K as well. Yeah the artwork's cool but pff, it's annoying when you've bought it once already and why, why the fuck do you need to buy it again? I don't know. Well I won't be doing it. And that's the only two pre-orders that are actually exciting me right now. Nothing much else. But sales wise yeah there's a couple of gems out there in a minute. Now if I tell you these sales and you think oh don't wait. Oh go get them now. You know what I mean? First one, we have Nightmare on Elm Street 1 through 7, the collector's box set. It's only £12.47. See the advert right in front of me? It's only £12.47 on Railwaves. They don't charge for delivery either. It's the Italian version. It's Italian writing on the front. Who cares? Have all those films are less than 13 quid? Oh, yes, please. I have ordered that myself and it's on its way. Now, the other one, which annoyed a lot, annoyed a lot of people at the time, The Strangers um, Pray at Night. What's the sequel to The Strangers, which is a good film? We never got it as a Blu-ray in the UK. Now this is a Danish import, but it's two pounds forty-four. Hello, two pounds forty-four. That's worth anyone's money. Uh, definitely worth getting. Again, that's rare waves as well. And last, because I'm starting to get more into me arrow titles now, the film Ghoul is three pounds eighty at the moment on rare waves. So that's three titles to take a look at. Let me know if you're going to get them in the comments down below. So that's what my focus was today. Now to give you an idea of some stuff that's actually turned up. Now if every, everybody knows this film. Battery's not included. Now we all remember the simple black guy in this. Yeah, not real big guy. Um, he died yesterday. Day before yesterday. How weird is it that I ordered the film he's in and it comes the day after he died. That's, this is a bit weird but... I've always wanted Batteries Not Included, a classic film we haven't seen yet, really heartfelt, good film. Next the one that arrived was very cheap as well, I've got Brother Bear 2. You know, it's one of the extra made for TV version films that you get with all of these main titles. I've got nearly all of them, but obviously anything helps to pad out the old Disney. And last but not least, this cost me like four quid. Um, the Premier Collection version of Badlands. So yes, I have yet another Premier Collection in, in my... Uh, in my collection there that we're now so yeah really happy with that especially the price and I think if memory serves me credit I've got another one on its way but I can't for the life of me remember the title's name I'll remember it at some point but until it's here I'll treat it like it's not here yet so that was my pickups let's give away some 4Ks now I'm giving this one away because this is my favourite of all the Star Wars Rogue One Let's give you away a 4K copy of Rogue One, shall we, for you guys? I mean, the the big the big fields at the start of the film, you know, oh, just looks amazing. And I've got myself another copy of Suicide Squad. Let's get that one out to people. And this one's got the slip. 
Now, you know how it works, guys. I fish my minion, and we see whose name gets pulled out. So, well done to the winners when they get pulled, and good luck to everybody. Let's get right in the middle of the pack. Right, so I have one. Oh, actually, I have two, so let's put them back in because there was two. Just to be fair. Right, I have one. So the winner of Rogue One in 4K is Nathan Bradshaw. Oh, well done, son. So, and Suicide Squad will go to. Come on now. Come on. I have a winner. So the winner of Suicide Squad 4K is Stephen Riley. Well done, son. Now, over the weekend, guys, you will get obviously what's coming out next week. There's a lot still coming out. I will have been ill, been a bit behind in the videos. I promise over the weekend, as long as I get the time to do it, because Sunday I'm supposed to be meeting up with a few YouTubers. We'll see how it goes. But I've still got to get my Marvel collection on video for you and my 4K collection. I'll get them done as soon as I can. But if, I've, I, if I, I want to get them done before I do my Monday What's Out video. So look out for those across the weekend and into the early parts of Monday. Uh, you'll have all the What's Coming Out in America, Germany and France across the weekend on my Facebook page as well. And look out for me on Instagram. Try and follow me on there as well if you can. Uh, there's my daughter coming in the door. Um, so I like talking to people on Instagram now as well and also if you're not subscribed already please give me a subscribe and a thumbs up on the video and then contact me on Facebook and then you can join in with the competitions for free it is that simple and enjoy the rest of your night guys hope your Friday is good I've got a headache and my eyes are going cross but there you go it's all part and parcel of life isn't it take care guys enjoy it and well done to the winners again and I'll see you over the weekend Take care now.